to our awards. So we're going to announce the top three awards. The top three prizes go uh, get a gift from the HBTA, and we'll also go on to the regional fair at WPI. And then nine additional projects from Hopkinton will go to the regional fair next week to represent Hopkinton High School. So the first uh, award like, I'd like to give out is the third place award. This goes to a freshman, Simran Carr, for the mystery behind aerial warfare. Okay, our second place award goes to a, student, a returning student, A. Nene, patient-specific delivery of proton beam radiation. Okay, and our first place award this year goes to a student, Rohan Minosha. Congratulations. So we have nine additional projects that are going to be going on to our regional fair at WPI. And before we um, announce these projects, I just want to make one note, which is most of these projects right now, if you went to any other school in Massachusetts and competed in their science fair, you would probably be one of the top three projects. We have an incredibly competitive project. Uh, group this year. This is the largest year in school history, so especially if you're a freshman or a sophomore, this is your first year doing it, we hope you've learned a lot from the experience. We hope you come back and can be up here in the future years. These people all started with a first year project. <coughs> Someone was only a ninth grader, but she started last year, right? So they get a lot of experience, and so we hope you come back and try it again. You can continue with your topic or study something totally new, but even if you're not one of our top 12 projects, we hope you learned a lot from this experience and enjoyed it. We're really proud of you, and you should feel really proud of yourself as well. Okay, so in no particular order, I have nine additional projects I'm gonna um, call out and I'm gonna ask you to come stand up here and then at the end, the top 12 are gonna meet to talk about some things for regionals and the rest of the students are gonna work on kind of breaking down their projects and cleaning up the room and resetting the library. If you would like to go home with a parent or guardian at the end, that's fine. That's fine with us. <laughs> that's fine with us. Um, but we just ask you help with the breakdown before we all pack up. Okay, thank you. Okay, so in no particular order, other top nine projects going to regionals. The first one we'll announce is Fateh Mohammed, a novel machine learning <laughs> Our next team, our ninth graders, are Cheetah Namali Conti and Tanisha Rajkumar. One when detecting an irregular heart rate using Arduino. Congratulations. Great job. Congratulations. Okay, our next uh, project going to regionals is Trusha Pudaraju, double sex involvement in fruit fly aggression. Our next team is Alisa Stolier and Alana Miller. Shazan Khan. <laughs> Engineering of congenic Huntington fibroblast cell lines using CRISPR. Next entry is Tyler Rhodes, early wildfire detection through thermal imaging in drones. Our next group, Siri Yaramsetti, Olivia Jones, and Ellery Shetty. Durability of UV resistant clothing, is it worth the investment? Congratulations. 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 And our last project is uh, for regional entry. It goes to a freshman. The judges were really impressed by this student's enthusiasm and hard work throughout his project, and we're really proud of him. The last entry for regionals is Gabe O'Brien, fingerprints through genetics.
thank you everyone for coming. Mr. Bishop, yes. Yes, uh, one last thing. Could you please join me in thanking Ms. Murphy? Uh, we could not ask for a more dedicated, committed person to run the science program. Uh, she is wonderful. Uh, she is so dedicated to the science fair. And today is her birthday. Oh.